Today, we are going to take a deep dive into Monmouth County, New Jersey. Monmouth County, New Jersey is located in central New Jersey with many of its towns located right along the beautiful New Jersey shore. There are so many fabulous things to say about Monmouth County, but there are a few not so fabulous things to say about the area as well. Today, I'm going to talk about it all the pros and the cons to living in Monmouth County. The first thing I want to talk about is the location. Monmouth County is positioned along the eastern coastline, bordered with the Atlantic Ocean to the east. Monmouth County is conveniently located south of New York City and is easily accessible from New York as well as Philadelphia. So if you're looking for a prime spot within the Garden State with the perfect blend of coastal charm and city proximity, Monmouth County may be the perfect spot for you. Which leads me to my next pro about Monmouth County, the commute. Let's be honest, I'm sure we all wish we didn't have to work, let alone commute. Commuting adds an entirely different level of stress. But here in Monmouth County, commuting isn't really that bad because we have so many options. New Jersey Transit, for example, offers rail service with 14 different locations scattered throughout Monmouth County. There's also New York Waterways operating service from Belford to Manhattan's Pier 11 and the World Financial Center, as well as the C Street operating from the Highlands and Atlantic Highlands to Pier 11. So if you prefer to take a ferry from Monmouth County, you have that option as well. And just recently, although it's not Monmouth County, it's considered Middlesex, they did just offer the fast ferry right out of South Amboy as well, which is just a few minutes outside of Monmouth County. There are also so many bus stops scattered throughout Monmouth County. I'm not going to name them all, but I will leave a link to all the public transportation options for Monmouth County in the description box below, so feel free to check those out when the video is done. The next big pro about Monmouth County are the school districts. Monmouth County truly is home to some fabulous schools. According to Niche.com, there is a huge majority of schools located here that are consistently receiving B plus to A plus ratings year after year. Home Dell, Upper Freehold, Freehold Regional, Manasquan, Wall, Madawan Aberdeen, Rumson, Fairhaven, Little Silver, and Marlboro, just to name a few, are consistently receiving top rankings when it comes to education. Here is an interesting fact I found when researching the education systems here in Monmouth County. New Jersey has the best state education system in the country, thanks largely to the high amount of money it spends on its schools, according to a new national ranking. That's pretty exciting. So the next pro about Monmouth County seems to be an extremely popular reason why so many people choose to call this area home. Can you guess what it is? Hmm. The Jersey Shore and our incredible beaches. I do not care what anybody says, we have some of the most incredible beaches in the country. You heard me, the Jersey Shore has some of the best beaches around. You do have to pay a fee to get onto the beaches here in Monmouth County, from Memorial Day to Labor Day. Yeah, that stinks. But you can buy a season badge to your favorite beach and you will be set for the entire summer. Monmouth County has over 20 beaches. There is a beach and a beach town here for everyone. Some beaches offer things like a boardwalk and amusements, while others offer nothing but pure peace and quiet. I do have a guide to all the beaches here in Monmouth County, so if it's something you're interested in, I will also leave that linked below in the description box, so grab a copy when this video's over.
Now it's time to touch upon some of the cons or not so great things about Monmouth County. After all, anywhere you live is going to have some not so great things, so let's talk about them. Although I don't really love talking about the negatives, I do want to point out some of these things. Just in case you're thinking about making the move to Monmouth County, you need to have all the information so you can make the best decision for you and your family. The first con on the list about Monmouth County is congestion. If you have been to New Jersey and specifically our area, I'm sure you noticed the amount of traffic and just how crowded it is. In all fairness, Monmouth County has always been a popular spot in the Garden State, but since 2020, there is an even higher amount of families relocating to our area. Traffic can be noticed during rush hour, especially when traveling to and from major areas like Newark, Jersey City, Manhattan, or even those who commute to Philadelphia. You may also experience traffic simply navigating busy shopping centers or some roadways. The residents here usually adapt to the flow of traffic and we know the best times to take and to avoid certain roadways. In the summertime, it is very crowded here and the traffic, it's pretty terrible. Everybody knows that on Thursday nights, a lot of people head down to the Jersey Shore. So yes, you will experience greater traffic in our area during the summer months. And when it comes to parking, be prepared. Parking in these beach towns, definitely not one of the best things about our area. But again, for those of us who live here and love the Jersey Shore, we've adapted. We know the best times to go and the best times to stay away. Another thing to add to the con list of New Jersey and Monmouth County is home prices. Unfortunately, prices here in Monmouth County are slightly higher than some of our neighboring areas. The county's proximity to the coast, excellent schools, and overall quality of life contribute to the demand for real estate, which influence property value. While these factors make it an attractive place to live, the higher cost of living, including property prices, can be considered a drawback for some. However, many feel that the investment is worth it for the amenities and the quality of life that Monmouth County has to offer. It's a balancing act between the initial expense and the long-term benefits of getting to live here in beautiful Monmouth County. New Jersey and Monmouth County overall aren't known for being budget friendly. And the cost of living and especially home prices reflects that. Another con that goes right along with the cost of home prices are taxes. The taxes here in New Jersey and in Monmouth County are pretty hefty. Property taxes in general are a significant part of the financial equation for homeowners. And it is definitely something to factor into your overall budget, especially when you're looking to purchase a home. While the county offers various amenities and a high quality of life, the higher tax burden can be a concern for residents looking to manage their expenses effectively. It is definitely essential to weigh the benefits against the financial consideration when considering purchasing a home here in Monmouth County, New Jersey. I'm going to give you one more pro about living here in Monmouth County, just to show you, in my opinion, the pros by far outweigh the cons. Another pro of our area, amenities and activities. Monmouth County offers a range of activities and amenities, making it an attractive place to call home. The county's well-maintained park system offers fantastic outdoor spaces, complemented by the beautiful beaches. The area here is truly a shopper's paradise, featuring a mix of chain stores, charming mom and pop shops, and fabulous supermarkets. Additionally, golf enthusiasts can enjoy top-notch golf courses throughout Monmouth County. 
with an abundance of options from recreational activities to diverse shopping, dining scenes, Monmouth County provides well-rounded and enjoyable lifestyle. There really is something for everyone and anyone to do, explore, and enjoy right here in Monmouth County. So there you have it, my updated 2024 list of the pros and cons of living here in Monmouth County, New Jersey. If you have any additional questions or would like some more information about anything I discussed today, please don't hesitate to ask. And if you are looking to buy or sell here in Monmouth County or anywhere in the amazing state of New Jersey, I would love the chance to sit down, discuss how I can help you either making Monmouth County your next home or helping you and your family move on to the home of your choice. Thank you so much for joining me. My name is Corey. I'm a local realtor with Remax Central, and I will catch you on the next one.